Hello everyone, as I promised, the video of the gobbledygooker will come out. I've also got another review of my Bruce Lee figure coming maybe today or tomorrow. But, alright, first, here's the box. As you can see, everything's already out. But here's the box. It didn't, the because I, I ordered off eBay, so it didn't come with The Undertaker, sadly. Only the gobbledygooker, but here's Survivor Series box. There's the side... There's the Goblet Yuka at Survivor Series 1990. Uh, Undertaker Goblet Yuka there. And this is when uh, the Undertaker debuted as well. Same with the Goblet Yuka. And I'll show you the box Gooka came in. Alright, and here is the box Goblet Yuka came in. So there. Side with Mean Gene. You can see. And uh, where's the little things? This is. Goldie, and at the bottom it says Gooper, I think. Oh yeah, Gooper. Alright. Now let me just get all these boxes out of the way. And it also comes with another box, if I just remove everything that's going to fall. This is the Survivor Series box, which is the, like, little stand the egg was on. Just says Survivor Series all around, and then just shows you how to put it together. So... There's that, and it also comes with uh, the backdrops, which are the same, it just has the Survivor Series crowds, and for some reason it has brick patterns on the back, which I don't really understand why, but you get two of them, which is really cool, and the egg, obviously, it opens, you know, like that, uh, it's inside. Once, it, once it's like snapped together, you can't really take it apart, but yeah. Pretty good. That's the uh, egg. Now, moving on to the Gobbledy Gooker. I'm so excited to have him in my collection. Um, so, the Gobbledy Gooker also comes with uh, like a more updated head. And then the two, if I, if I can get them, oh my goodness, the two open hands. So, looking at the articulation, this is the head that he debuted in, and this was originally meant to be a basic figure a long time ago until it got cancelled. Don't know why. Also, one thing that sucks about this is if you lift the arms up, the arms snap off straight away. And don't worry, it's not broken. It's meant to do that. So, chill. Um, but if we actually do take all the bits off. Like I said, it doesn't really, you know, if you take this off, you can just see it's just a brown body. I don't know if you can take the other pieces off. I really don't want to risk it. Let me just put it all back together. And here he, he is with these other hands on. Um, now, articulation is a little bit stiff. Like I said, you can't really lift the arms up, which is a very sucky thing. As you can see, he is on... Is he on ball joints, I think? Yeah. Double-jointed knees. Um, doesn't really have any articulation in the feet besides it's spinning. I don't know if it tilts. I think so. Um, no, waist can spin all the way around. No. So, pretty... Pretty good articulation. I'll just quickly put the other head on. Also, one thing to notice, he doesn't really stand well. So, here he is with his, like, updated head on. Pretty uh, big, if you ask me, the head. And this is, like, kind of based off when he won, like, the 20... Oh, did he win the 24-7 championship? I don't remember. But this is him a couple of years ago. Whenever it was. So, yeah. Um, I'll just quickly... I won't pause it this time, don't worry. Here's a look of him in the egg. Also, if you want to display him like with the egg piece coming out, I would recommend putting it maybe under his feather. As you can see, it stays. Which is really cool. Obviously, I don't have the Mattel Mean Gene. I have an LJN Mean Gene. So you could do the do si -do. Kind of like that, you know. Um. So, yeah. This is the... Gobbledygooker. So, thank you guys 
so much for watching. If you liked it, hit like, subscribe, turn on post notifications. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.